What's up guys and welcome to a brand new environment. You've not seen this before. We are at Gracie Baja. 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 With Mr. Chris Clark. Also known on Instagram as Clark Fit. And today we're gonna to be putting you guys through, well we're gonna be doing it, a circuit for you guys to be able to do wherever you are. You're gonna be able to adapt this. It's gonna push you. You're gonna be doing three minute rounds, 30 second stations and you're gonna be pushing yourself. And this is a classic workout that is, it's what you put in this one. Yep. How much you put in is what you're gonna get from it. Exactly. Now, Chris is fit. I'm kind of just getting back into being cardio fit. So I'm gonna think I'm gonna be chasing your pace on this one, but let's have a quick look around at what we're gonna be doing. Over to you. Uh, so we're gonna do this single arm kettlebell snatch. And so I like taking like an over exaggerated overhand grip here um, and basically just bring it up and flip it at the top and then bring it back down for 30 seconds. Chris is saying before he doesn't like doing the, the clean and press because it slams on the back and bruises the back of the wrists, which is true. As you flip it up, sink underneath it and then drive up through your legs. Um, because like Chris said, if you let it just slam over, it's going to bruise you. As well, we're going to be doing hip thrusts. So demonstration. To, but you're, gonna, you're doing that the wrong way around. Don't try and cheat this now. What, you Don't try and cheat. The heavy is the hip thrust. <laughs> this is the cleans. <laughs> so what you'll see here, look, is upper body is not flipping forward and back up. So we're driving through the hips. It's almost a squat and drive through the heels. The other variation of this is you can do a little bit more of less leg work and just kind of drive through with the hips and glutes as well. So we're going to be showing you certain ways of doing this. <laughs> Feel free to adapt this. Everything is 30 seconds. You're going to be doing three minutes, 30 seconds. So that is one minute station right there. Super easy. And if you don't have kettlebells, you can do this with dumbbells. You're going to be drilling with a partner in theory, but if you're on your own, just set yourself 30 second timers and off you go. So we will then run from this station. We're going to come over. When you hear a shout wall ball, I'm talking about this, which is basically a medicine ball on a rope. And the idea of this one is ro rotational uh, core strength on this. What it's going to want to do is as you rotate, this from left to right and slam it, it's gonna to wanna to pull you forward with that inertia. So the idea is to plant your feet and really hold it back and pin with your core and really work. This isn't an arm swing, we're swinging from the torso, real rotation and real slam there. If you don't have this, you can just get medicine ball, something heavy and literally just rip side to side or you can have a barbell across the top. Just make sure it's nice and secure, put your hands over the top and you can rotate, stop, but make sure you're actually forcing that stop with the abs before rotating back through again. From here, 30 seconds are up. We're gonna run, slam balls. So we've got 10 kilo weight ball here. Simple, slam as hard as you can each time. Really putting effort in through. 30 seconds, constant, slam, slam, slam. 30 seconds up from there. What we're gonna do, we're gonna do some one twos, real simple. Now, Chris is a jits guy, so he's not, in, massively in striking are you not really doing it at all so this again isn't so much about the technique more about the work and effort you're going to put in but we're going to look to keep some certain techniques so when you're throwing your punches real simple trick turn them over as you throw them and it'll automatically give you a nice little pull through the hips and just keep you in a nice alignment we're throwing from the chin and aim to come back so we're going to be doing one twos chasing it down one two my, at my discretion i'm going to switch it up and we've run 30 seconds we're going to hit the ground into full guard from here, I'm gonna clip, I'm gonna pull him in, I'm gonna make him work, so I'm gonna make him strike. So I'm gonna go five elbows to the right, he's gonna drill them. Two, three, four, five, left. Same thing, three, four, five. Now post up, so we get to stand, and from here, we're just gonna drop bombs. Two, three, four, five, same. Two, three, four, five, and back into guard, and so on. And from here, if you want to do just tens as well, pop, 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 pop. It's all about work weight, work weight. So you have 30 seconds of hellfire, but this is as difficult as you're gonna make it. So, Chris is gonna go first. <laughs> Marty <Marley> Dard. <laughs> <laughs> it's my job now. I'm gonna be calling out when he changes. I'm gonna be pushing and I'm gonna make him, every time he starts to look like he's gonna slow down, I'm gonna scream him to pick it up. If you don't have a partner to doing this with, with the, uh, the pad work, you can simply, if you've got a bag, you can just use that for ground and pound. Obviously, if you have a bag, 
uh, available to you. Just do some stand up on the bag, doing punch outs and things like that. Obviously just adapt it to what equipment you have available. Anything else you want to tell them? I'm ready. Let's, do it. ready. Let's <laughs> do it. Let's go. Let's go. Driving through. Let's get it. Fire him. Okay. 15 seconds. Last five. Four. Three. Two. One. Put it down. Let's go. Wall ball. Move, 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 move. Let's go. Two, one, switch it. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, five, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Four, finish them. Three, two, and one. Let's move, let's move. Jump and slam. Nice. 15 seconds. Two, one, turn and strike. Let's go. Keep going, keep going, keep coming. Ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ba, ba. Again. Ba, ba. Again. Ba. Onto the floor. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Post up. Bombs. Two, three. Knock them out. Four. Again. Knock them out. One, two, three, four, five. Drop down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Big right. Big right. Big left. Big left. Right elbow. Finish. Boom. Nice. <laughs> Don't forget to breathe! Alright, this might cry. <laughs> <laughs> you made that look a little easy. It worries me. <laughs> I can see it when you have it. 20 more seconds. <laughs> We're driving through legs, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Right. Left. Stand up. Ten. Left. <laughs> Oh. Okay, that was round one. Ooh. Like I said, this is as hard as you make it. Ah. I could have bitched out. I could have not pushed as hard on the kettlebell swings. I could have not thrown my strikes on the four full power. The point is, I know it's only three minutes, it's only 30 seconds. Put the fucking work in. If you aren't feeling like this, you're not working hard enough. Three to five rounds of this, once or twice a week, you're gonna feel it. Okay, Let's go. round two. Yeah, sometimes I think that I'm unstoppable. Yeah, ready to go, man, lock and load. That's right. I swear to God that I could drop you, bro. Yeah, I got a shot and I ain't stopping, no. That's how I know that I'm a stoppable. That's how I know that I'm a stoppable. Shit, let's go. I don't care what they all say. That's right. I'ma do this thing my way. Let's go. 
addicted to the crime, man So I refuse to waste time, man One day it all will be fine, man Gotta commit to the crime, You know we're back with the Guinness Setting records every minute Every track in addiction to the fact that we're winning Still we lack something's missing Need a track that is hitting Making racks, making millions Call your harass, that's a mission so there you go, you've got a circuit there that you can adapt and put into your own routines really easily. But, that's a little unfair on Chris because he's not really a striking guy, are you? No. No, he's more into the jiu-jitsu and he's into gi jiu-jitsu, but nonetheless, jiu-jitsu. And you've been rolling for like two, three years now? Probably two. Two I'm years, two, okay. Yeah. I've been rolling two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so now we're going to go into Chris's world. We look about the same. Physiques look similar. We're nice, we're relatively similar builds. What weight are you? Like 185. Right. Yeah, so we're not that far off weight wise. I, I'm down to like 175 now. So uh, now we're going to show you the difference between technique versus just raw wiggliness. And we're going to see how many times I'm put into weird positions that make me make a weird noise or tapped in three minutes. You ready? I'm ready. Right. Three, two, one. Bong! Okay. <laughs> oh, we do this one as well. <laughs> oh, you see, I know he's working for something, but I can't stop it. <laughs> <laughs> It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. <laughs> this is not where I want to be. Yeah, this is not where I want to be. <laughs> I want that time a beep. Chris shit backpack. <laughs> At no point in that roll was I even slightly close to anything but defensive. There wasn't a tap. There wasn't a tap. This is true, but I definitely lost man points. <laughs> oh, you can see the difference between technique. He was flying around, just going to do anything to stop him. I know certain things I'm supposed to be doing, but the technique's just not there yet. So, thank you for that. Yeah, that was fun. Humbling. <laughs> but hopefully. We'll get to do a bit more later on when I've got a little bit more rolling under my belt. And uh, it's been a pleasure. And we shall be back. Yep. Hope you've enjoyed this session of uh, Undisputed. I hope we've shown you that you can look good and be a savage. <laughs> Check out Chris on Instagram. All the links and everything will be in the description below. We'll catch you in the next episode of Undisputed. Oh, baby. Lately I've been doing shit different Cooking like a chef, I've been all up in the kitchen Had to make a move, had to make a little distance A lot of people tripping, they could never see the vision Fuck that, tell them bounce